Alright. <laughs> so I'm against a Yone. As lethal tempo as per usual. Um he has second wind on. Um and he has teleport. So this matchup can be a little bit rough early, but if they overextend you can kill them. Um and same as quite a lot of matchups, you get two items, change them and you just became just become well too much for them. Um looks like they're because this guy showed down here, I'm presuming that they started top, so I'm gonna walk in. In with a Q here. No point in warding because I won't get the second Q off until he's here, so I can just wait until it's here now. Um, yeah. Try not to take too much Q harass and try not to get your passive knocked off by his uh, Q. Oops. I go for a hard trade here, level 2. That's really nice. Didn't take too much minion damage and just got like, quite a lot of health from him. He goes in on me, it's really good. Okay, if he Q, if he Q towards me there, I'd probably get him with a Q and try and go all in on him. I know they're jungling up his path in towards bot lane, so I have a lot of free time to play a 1v1 matchup. My jungler is going to be here first, so if he pushes in, I don't want him to get the crash off, because I want my jungler to be able to gank, but this is like a perfect wave. Oops. That's fine for me. He's got, no, he's got no E now. I have no passive, so I need to be a little bit more careful. But we're good. He's gone. To, he's already warded, so I'll put a ping there. Oops. Probably don't walk up into him usually. He's going to be able to get it off. Very badly. Oops. Nice. Oh. I can push this and get a reset off. He's probably going to teleport back. He reset. He didn't reset. I can get a base off, and if he freezes here, it's okay. He should probably W those minions and try to E at me. It's not my base, but because he has an I'll just go get these two ruby crystals. Makes the game a lot easier now. If that's hard pushing this wave, I will teleport back. If not, then I'll just let the slow push kill more, kill more of my minions than it kills of his. And it'll push towards me, because it's a stacked wave. Uh, he's got to use teleport back like this. This is good from him to use teleport back here. A lot of really, really top laners would just allow um, allow themselves to lose a lot of XP here. He's not shouldn't have pushed as hard though. And pushing hard is not good for him. But it's like I mean, he's half there, right? He wants to kind of get a slow push here. I think. <laughs> I think he should have stacked another wave. It'll crash a little bit earlier than he wants. I think the wave will be in a rough position for him. That's good, I got Z out. He's a long cooldown. Oh shit. Oh god. I'll go ward now, he's got no E, so he can't like harass me massively. His junglers should be topside though. He said a reset after the bot gank. He's W in late, so I'm getting trades off before he gets a shield, which is always really nice. His jungler could potentially lane gank, but he doesn't have E, so I think I survive it. I mean, actually, I just don't think he will in this elo. Have I put sticky keys on them? Interesting. A really bad E from him. Oh, if 
I didn't have a cannon. Oh, I should have gone for it. I missed the cannon anyway. I'm, just... <sighs> I'm gonna crash it here. Uh, I'm really tilted that I didn't get the cannon. So I could have either gone for him and burnt his flash or got the cannon, and I just didn't either. I should have chosen one earlier. Yeah. I can just pull this wave and just clear it here. If I get an even better recall. I know nobody can be here, I've seen everybody on the map. Go to his red buff. Go ward here, he'll come out of base and come to here. I could have potentially placed that ward a bit later. It's okay. Oh, this guy could come over this wall. <laughs> With the E. He didn't. <clears throat> Sad. It's not who you want to see all the kills on. Get this to me here. It's good for me. I'll try and block his ulti. He's dead. Uses E. Uh, I can keep a freeze so I can push it in. I think I'll push it in because he hasn't got teleport, so... I think it will just stack back towards me by the time he gets back into lane anyway, as long as I push it reasonably hard. Nice space. She's going to come towards top. Or she'll go over the wall here. Probably to clear this. He's got no flash as well because he wasted his flash there, so I can also re-kill him in a second because I'll have red buff when he's overextended again. The only thing is I need to see is Diana cross again. Diana could go for this, so I'll go check it straight away. Not that I can stop it. It's a bit of information, right? Probably. Like this with this. Okay. I don't know where his Diana is. Bit spooky. Could be a little reset. I want to go aggressive on him though. I want to abuse his red buff as much as I can. Nice. And there's Bart, so. I'm going to get this just for the health back. Oh, get a lot of plates. If I saw the down on the crab there, I probably would have taken our blue buff so that she didn't take it afterwards. But it's also maybe it's like close because I kind of want to come and punish the overextend when I have red buff, right? So I can proxy quite hard here. That's okay. Door is down there, so play those minions fast. Well, I didn't get any of those minions. I'm fucking fuming. Okay. I'm gonna get this and Tabby's. It was the Dana. Get this. Might put my chains on the Diana as soon as I see her. Early, like a very early chains in there. Yeah, I will. Used ulti then. Didn't hit. Oops. I can get bot now and then teleport top. It's like a play, but I don't think that I can get the kill off. In fact, I'm gonna go. Now I'll just teleport towards top. I've got no ulti, but it's okay. They might be dead. 
I get played away. I'll go for the Thresh. That wasn't very fast on the follow up. Cool, that was good. I can kill this guy. He's gonna flash over. I'm gonna put back to top now and I'm gonna use my ulti. Make sure we're getting all the XP. Gonna stay for the dragon, but I kind of want to get the XP. I can come back top. I haven't got my chains on him, and I haven't got ulti, so... Not the... Well, I mean, I win anyway, but... Dana looks like she's researched, so she's going towards red buff. Our base. Well, it's not a great base, to be honest, but... Um, just for health, really. I don't have anything else to do that's not reckless. It's only flash. Go through mid. I want to go towards bot this lane, this game, this uh, this time because I don't have my overextend here and bait the Dana. Dana. Probably done this now. Yeah, she cleared towards bot. I'm going to push this because Dana should be going towards bot now. There. I'll stop his base quickly before the minions get there. I'm gonna make him teleport back to lane if he wants to. Let this turret. Might ulti onto me straight away. Definitely potential for it from him. Should be able to survive it. I can definitely take this turret now. I can't. I thought this guy would stay for longer. Strange he didn't. Strange behaviour. I'll go take this. Take the top camps because my. I don't want this bot anyway. But that way, push into me. Go push out top. So strange that guy didn't stay around. The proper reset so fast afterwards. I guess he got quite a lot of kills. Right, so you see this guy here. There's potential. Keep pushing. Gonna have to flash. I'll get the top turret now. The regank here would be so crazy from the downer. But it'd be really good. But it really would be crazy. I think I'll be alright anyway. Cool. I need to just go over. He's level 6, man. He needs to ulti and run away. Oh, well, he's so low level. Probably go MR. Just for these two, because they're going to be doing damage. They actually are. I think that is really hard to stop. Mm, can maybe go here and bait.
Nice, my eighty hit. Okay, they surrendered. Well, GG, I guess. I don't know why they surrendered so early, but yeah. <clears throat>